Greetings everyone, this is Shawar Khan and in this lesson we are going to talk about HTTP GET method. Now when we normally open a site, like when you open, when we request a, um, an image, a web page, normally this method is used. GET method is used for requesting data from the server. Like sometimes we open a web page, like we request any kind of image now get method is used for these kind of purposes and when we open a web page using get method that's how the request look like technically here you can see the word get at the start of the request that's the get verb or get method that indicates the method being used Next is the path or the location of the file that we are requesting on the server. And that's the structure of the GET request. We got the status line, we got the headers, and nothing special here. And all the parameters or data is in the status line or the URL. Like if there's some kind of data being transferred, we will see it in the status line. This method is mostly used for requesting data, for requesting web pages, and for doing these kind of stuff. Get method is an insecure method if it's used for authentication or for transferring sensitive data. That's because everything transferred via get method is shown in the status line or the URL bar. Now, for example, if I request, um, if I send some data like um, name is equal to name equal shower and password equal Khan. Now this data will be shown here in the request in the status line. So that's a risk because these URLs and these kind of data is saved can be saved in history or these kind of stuff. So it's an insecure method if used for authentication.